I will be soon. So, oh, now if I buy a customization, can I use that on any of my ships? Uh, that's a good question. If it's purple, can I put purple on everything? I don't know. I don't know if it's per ship or not. Unfortunately. So you get a whole host of new abilities with later ships. Oh yeah. I have a feeling I'm going to waste many hours in this. <laughs> Alright, what are we waiting for? <coughs> Just give me Are a second invite? here. <laughs> oh, okay. So apparently with the tier 1 I cannot put um, a hull repair boost on my engineering ship. No? Now hold on, how do I check how close I am to get into the next... Uh, click on your ship. ship. Just click on your ship, and then it says synergy level. It says it in ship saw hangar when you click on your ship. Oh, it says current the, synergy your, level yeah. up. Yeah, oh, and then it. The, yeah, that's it. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't see it. It was right there in front of me. <laughs> I was like, oh, <laughs> oh, Ooh. now I get it. <laughs> so I unlock the harpy and the Hercules rage at the next level. Oh, nice. Now, I don't, yeah, I think so. I'm not so. really using these flares. Should I buy another module here? Sure. I, I, I got shield. Booster. I got shield resistance and armor resistance. That's oh, yeah, is it worth upgrading like my, the shield boosters are. and stuff for your modules? Uh, if you hover over the upgrade, it'll show what it what the boost is. No, I mean, is it worth upgrading it? Like, am I going to use these throughout the game? Say... Or... No. Okay, then uh, fuck that. <laughs> upgrading uh... items is locked to the tier for that ship. Once you go up to the next tier, it's all new items. All new reset timers. Got it. Much more powerful items, actually. Right. So may as well do. Alright, you guys ready? Yeah. So you'll get the same name of the item, but it will be a lot stronger version of it. Different one. This is ah, this one. Our mission is to repel the enemy attack at all costs. Hold on. Uh, is this the one you did the first time? I think so. Yeah, this is the one that ends in the boss. I like the sound effect for the cloaking. First enemies come from over here.
Okay, second group comes from up here. B needs help. I'm there. It's done. It's, it's B's good. B is golden. Okay, next group should spawn right around where I am. There they are. Lag. How's there sound in space? Because we're hearing a simulation of it through our headsets. Oh. In our helmets. Yeah, yeah. They found that pilots were crap when they had nothing to listen to. So they used video <laughs> game... They used the video game sound pack. <laughs> but I thought that's why we had an MP3 player. Yeah, that's what it is. But it's got a soundboard for sci-fi. You know, you okay, can third and final room. group is coming from over here. <laughs> oh god, the... The lag. I see him. They're all dead. Leave some for us, jeez. <laughs> oh, lots more are coming. Change the name of these guys. Yay! Is that it? Nope, there's one. We missed one somewhere. Over here. Oh, we must have made B. it. Is he? Or is it A? I don't know. Oh crap, there he is. <laughs> he got he got wrecked. <laughs> Missile. Yeah. Okay, number two is destroy the nav stations. I'm gonna assume there's more than this later on too. Well, there's a PvP side to it, I think, which mm -hmm. means this can be quite basic. There is also an open world. Really? I don't know if you guys can access it yet, but you should be able to. Oh, oh there's a, boy, just a wait, there's an open world? Oh my god. Okay, uh -huh. we need to check that out in a minute. Hang on. Take out the turrets, turrets first if you can. There's a lot of pirates and a couple of elite pirates that will be spawning. The elites are extremely hard to kill, but we need to keep them suppressed. Three nav stations we need to kill. God, that guy was annoying.
Are we shooting? Oh, by the way, station? if you stop firing just before your weapon overheats, you don't have to wait for the cooldown. Changed the name of the uh, enemies since I last played. Yeah, that's a lot of pirates. Yep, yeah, run and hide if you have to. Cram yourself in a small area or something where they can't see you. Cloaky module for the win. Oh god. Oh god. What is this, death by a thousand youth? Look at that! Remember, all we have to do is kill the three nav stations and we win. Epic! Whoa. Overheating. One. Oh, did we get one? Yeah, yeah we, we did. did. Missiles. Ah, I got one. Nice, where's the last one? There it is. Let's get it. Oh crap, don't hit it. New wave. Got it. Yay! <laughs> okay, to say uh, that was tricky. That was tricky. Oh god, this one. Just make sure you stay hidden. <laughs> stay hidden. Can't do. Winning. Best place is straight ahead and uh, in between the wings of the ship at the end. I'll show you where. Okay, straight down and to the left a bit. See that opening? Best place is to hide in there. Go quick because his uh, laser hurts just a bit. This lens flares on my screen. Ow.
They also have the orange trail. So you're saying we can hide under here, right? Yes. Oh, so whatever it says take cover, make sure you're behind something, between something and the boss. And even the this elites looks... he summons later hurt like hell. Dude, this is amazing. It's mesmerizing. I love it. It's so the attention to detail is great. Look out! It's all right. I think I'm in cover. Where are you guys? I'm under here. All clear. Incoming. Okay, the X3 ones are the uh, elites. Duly noted. Looks like we only get uh, the fighter elites. We don't get the frigate elites, thankfully. me when I was cloaking. What is this? Okay. So apparently uh -oh. in this difficulty his beam mode doesn't last for long and uh, he only sends the fighter elites. He doesn't send the really nasty frigate elites. His, uh, the boss's sniper beam tickles. <laughs> yeah, so in, apparently in, it's only a threat in higher tiers. In higher tiers, that sniper will rip you apart and last quite a while. Kind of silly. <laughs> That's all right, mate. You're used to him being harder, you know. Oh yeah. <laughs> it makes sense because, like I was saying earlier, we're all like brand new players. Yeah. I can see why they made it so easy. Because that guy used to kill everybody. Used to be finished with like one player left alive type of thing. Yay, loot! I don't understand what I'm doing. Basically anything green or colored is good. The gray stuff is just credits. Extra credits for you. Right. Okay, so I can either buy a Harpy or a Hercules Rage. I would say Harpy, but I'm kind of biased towards uh, frigates. <laughs> Yay! Upgrade, now I can buy an axe. Interceptors, by the way, have their niche. Interceptors are beacon captures. I've got a guard frigate and an axe. Yo, I got a plasma gun kit that freaking brings it up to 
purple. Ooh, nice. purple. What level? Level one? Yep. Oh, I got a beam cannon kit. Those are good. Ooh, I got new implants. Yo, this heartbeat though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is the game somebody was uh, doing. Um, uh, somebody was using this as in inspiration for a build. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Yo, so implants. Um. <laughs> yeah. Implants, exactly my thought. Yeah, uh, Delma. Yeah? Go up the bottom until you find the sticks. Right click and go preview. That's my current frigate. With a custom paint job on it. Yes, please. <laughs> it's got the combat drones, which are one of my favorites. The sticks is actually the toughest ship in the game. You can outfit that thing even tougher than tier 4s and 5s. Like, you know the effective hit points or something? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I've got, uh, let's see, my Raptor, for example, that we're using right now, has 20,000. My Sticks has... how much was that again? 62,000. Okay, well, I went, low. I went for increased sensor range and weapon range and extra HP. <coughs> so that's cool. What have I got under contract? Sign a contract with a faction. All current contract progress will be reset. Is that right? Do I want to choose a faction? Okay, choose a faction and stick with it. Uh, the points you get from those will give you, um, how should I put that? Okay, the points you get from that, certain items can be upgraded to tier 4 based on faction, with faction XP. Well, all of them can, but each of them falls under a different faction. If the item you're upgrading matches the faction that you have points in, you'll be able to use those points to upgrade it to tier 4 rather than paying gold or using a kit. So do I want to do that then? Yes, you want to stay with a uh, stay with one faction for a while and so, gain up a lot of points with it. Wait, but uh, which faction? Legion or wardens? I I'm Legion basically. At the I'm with myself. Legion as well. Then why not? Um, Tom, you are Jericho, right? So you're most likely going to want raid all, or Tex. Well, I'm kind of all of them, aren't I? Really, okay. I've got one of each, so. Yeah, generally you want to sign with one of the two for I'll your faction because that will give you the most right, upgrades. Right. Well, if I want to, does it make any difference if I'm playing with you guys? Nope. <laughs> so what's the point? Why would I want to do faction? it six times? Yeah. Why? Why would I want to do it six times if it's all the same? That's what I'm saying to you. No, no, no. Um, it's hard to explain, really. Okay. Um. If you go and hover over an item, or click on an item and go to upgrade, to upgrade to tier 4, which is the blue from green, you require loyalty vouchers for one of the six factions. Each oh, okay. item has a, has a group it's associated with. So when you pick certain items, you'll be able to upgrade to tier 4 without a kit or gold. Using the, lo the loyalty you get from the contracts. So it doesn't really matter which contract you pick, you just want to pick one of them and get a lot of points with them. Okay. I can buy a Raptor. Well, I'm happy. I've got a new ship, so... <laughs> I could probably get the other think... one as well. We're stinking rich. I think you can take up to... Oh, I'm actually, it doesn't look like... That. That's Wait a minute. The new if one. you double click on if you double click on one of the contracts, do you get uh, do you have to accept it? No, I just clicked on one of them. I I didn't actually click on any contracts. What's I'm just waiting for the next implants? match, guys. Okay. Uh. Are we gonna, are we gonna die? 
A little bit. No, no I shouldn't. Just stay near me, and there's no way you'll you'll die. Darn it! I picked the wrong ship. I wanted my new one. Oh wow! Oh, I well. got beam lasers. I fire explosive projectiles. I love this gun. I don't get many cruise missiles. No, nor do I. Don't get what? Many cruises. is under attack. That worked. So what do you think of that uh, disintegrator? I just found it. I like it. I <laughs> really like it. It's good for sniping a long range. So you would like this one too, Del. The oh. weapon I've got is, is the coil mortar. Which is, uh, as you see, explosive. So all you have to do is get near the target, and it explodes and takes out everything in the area. Who's firing drones? That's my missile on this ship. I can add more than the two default drones. And ranged drones. Huh. I also have on right now the toggles that repair your shields, repair your hull, and gives you energy back. Alright. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't think there's any weapon better for this than the coil mortar for the PBEs. Because it just takes out groups. And I'll switch to something fun. else. <laughs> I want to use my new ship. So, it's alt is special. Huh? F. Oh. Alt moves you down, space moves you up. Ah, oh, right. Which helps when you're trying to spiral towards something so you don't get hit as much. Oh, sorry, it's when I was looking at the information menu. If you press Alt, it tells you more about it. <laughs> so I'll be sniping with you, Delmont. We're gonna need the others to cover us. Well, Enemy
I like this new ship. I like my new ship, but it's not as fun to fly. It's just more powerful. Yeah, the the new weapons you get at tier two and three, you'll really like. I haven't hit tier four yet, so I don't know what I get there. This is Seems another like game where they've like, changed uh, how everything works multiple times. Interceptors, Tom. Huh? Seems like you like interceptors. Mmm. The high, fast-paced. Yeah. So I'm gonna be suicidal, and uh, you guys are gonna have to take care of most of this one. So I'm gonna fly an interceptor. I like the lasers, though. Lasers win all. Oh, you should have told me I could have brought my jammer. Oh, Yelby's on it. Yes, Yelby. Overdrive! Incoming. They are all over me. I know what you mean. Oh hell, I got two of the threes on me. I ain't getting out of this alive. Get near, uh... I can't. Whoever, who has the uh, hull repair guy? Get in somewhere and hide if you can. And dead. Dead. Oh boy. <laughs> Every time I take my interceptor. Yeah. Never take an interceptor again, Zai. It's, it's, it's fun it's with Zerenica again. How do, how do I switch when I'm spectating? Press to click the mouse. There's only me left. <laughs> yeah. Oh. But if you click the mouse, you can get the 360 cam on Zai. And you can zoom in and out with the middle mouse. You can see how crazy it is. Oh, warp what drive. Warp, dri warp drive? Yeah, he has warp yep, drive. Yeah, micro warp drive. Can we have that in Star Mate, please? <laughs> That's what our overdrive is for the most part, isn't it? No, it's not. Pretty much. Bad enough. It must make tunnel. Maybe if you had a charge up and a tunnel effect, you know, like a charge it up and let go, boom. I'd be okay with that then. That would work. Go on, Sai, you can do it. You can do it, mate. We believe in you. How many can be in a team? Dunno. We had four though. I think this will be my last game though. <laughs> I've been on it all night. <laughs> Goes Irenica. Whew. 
Question is, can he win this for us? Don't know. I died because I had pretty much every fighter after me. I had that guy after me, this guy here that he's on now. I think I had like five behind me. I think he's already killed them. It's this pro. Go on, take him down. Yes, revenge kill. Yeah, there's engines. like four of them though, is the problem. Wow, those engines are cool. We need trails in Starmade, that's all I'm saying. Trails. Yeah, look behind this, your best Oh trail. yeah, like trails, yeah. I think that might be part of particles though, I don't know. Who if knows? it is, we're capable of getting three of them. Take cover, Zai. He's gonna use his super special beam cannon. Oh, you're going straight in. Wow, that's brave. This gun sounds like a pistol. Yeah. yeah. He's still got like three quarters of his health. I don't think I can do this. Oh, his shields down. Oh, you got another yeah, wave. Yeah, but they'll, they'll regenerate. Oh, that's a shame. All right, well, that's cool. Well, basically, guys... Uh... I'm going to keep trying. Oh, okay. It's going to take me a long time if I do manage to pull it off. Ah. Right. Well... In that case. Oh. Yeah, it's not doing anything. I think you're supposed to have two people helping you, or maybe three. <laughs> <laughs> Fair play, though. I admire your valiant efforts. <laughs> this is just <laughs> right. So there you go, guys. This is Star Conflict. So uh, thanks for watching. We'll be continuing to play this, I guess, because it's pretty awesome. And uh, yeah, see you next time.